What is nanotechnology in civil engineering? Nanotechnology is the study of materials and systems at the nanoscale, which is the scale of molecules and atoms. In civil engineering, nanotechnology is an emerging field that involves the manipulation of materials at the nanoscale to develop new materials and improve the performance of existing materials used in construction. Nanotechnology can be applied in several areas of civil engineering including Construction materials Nanotechnology can be used to enhance the properties of construction materials such as concrete, steel, and polymers. For example, the addition of nanoparticles can increase the strength and durability of concrete, making it more resistant to cracking and corrosion. Sensors Nanotechnology can be used to develop sensors that can detect structural damage and deterioration in buildings and infrastructure. These sensors can provide real-time data that can be used to monitor the health of structures and prevent failure. Water treatment Nanotechnology can be used to develop new materials for water treatment that can remove contaminants such as heavy metals and bacteria. These materials can be used in water filtration systems and can help to provide clean drinking water in areas where it is not readily available. Energy efficiency Nanotechnology can be used to develop new materials for insulation and coatings that can improve the energy efficiency of buildings. These materials can help to reduce heating and cooling costs and contribute to sustainable building practices. Nanotechnology has the potential to revolutionize the field of civil engineering by improving the performance and sustainability of construction materials and infrastructure. There are several ways in which nanotechnology can be used to improve the built environment. Nanotechnology can be used to improve a wide variety of materials, including glass, concrete, and steel. Coatings such as paints can benefit from nanoparticle additions for self-healing capabilities and corrosion resistance under insulation. Hydrophobic coatings can prevent water from penetrating a metal pipe and shield it from the corrosive effects of salt water. Incorporating nanotechnology into civil engineering and building has huge potential benefits. Application of nanotechnology in the construction industry. The application of nanotechnology in the construction industry can extend the useful life of concrete, make steel resistant to fire, and endow materials with self-healing and self-cleaning properties. The planning, building, and engineering of structures and other physical infrastructure are of great personal interest to us. I've always been fascinated by the process of constructing from the days of paper model making with my siblings to the present day. As aspiring engineers we hope to one day be able to conduct studies that lead to the development of improved and more durable building materials. Nanotechnology is a crucial part of civil engineering because it has the potential to and has already significantly altered the way the subject is practiced by introducing novel material possibilities. This is why we think nanotechnology ought to be taught in more engineering classes across the world. Only a small fraction of universities provide nanotechnology instruction inside their engineering programs, and even fewer offer nanotechnology as a major. This needs to change especially for civil engineering, where nanotechnology is essential to future progress. Application of nanotechnology in concrete The use of nanotechnology in concrete is widespread and highly beneficial in the field of civil engineering. So, concrete deteriorates with time since it is a multi-phase composite material with a nanostructure. It has an amorphous phase, crystals from the nanometer to micrometer range in size, and bound water. It's used for everything from paving roads and bridges to constructing structures. One manner in which concrete can be altered is by including nanoparticles. Most studies involving nanoparticles use silica, titanium dioxide, and rarely iron alumina and clay as their material of choice. These nanoparticles' strong reactivity allows them to serve as nuclei for cement phases, which improves cement hydration, as nano-reinforcement, and as filler, which densifies the microstructure and the its and decreases porosity. For instance in 2009, NIST engineers patented a method of employing nanotechnology to increase the longevity of concrete. One-fourth of America's bridges were deemed unsafe or inaccessible that same year because chloride and sulfate ions would penetrate the concrete and weaken it from the inside out resulting in cracks, this was the rationale. The goal of the NIST's research called viscosity enhancers reducing diffusion in concrete technology verdict was to increase the durability of concrete by having the rate at which chlorides and sulfates enter the material. Please feel free to like, comment and share.